gonna sew a dress today and I'm gonna vlog it and this is my first YouTube video so if you like it subscribe below <laughs> um if you hear like wind and stuff in the background it's just my air because it's like hot and humid here so yeah if that annoys you I'm sorry I'm gonna get a microphone soon but also if you like to smoke um then take some hits with me because I'm going to be throughout the whole video but I'm not gonna show it because I don't think I'm allowed to do that so yeah let's jump into it so yeah, I'm just gonna show you how I sew a dress beginner friendly I might throw in some tips this isn't like a tutorial it's just gonna be like a vlog and hi my name is Hazel and let's get into the video um so here's my little workstation and here's my pattern that I made for the dress bodice and um, it's pretty simple. I just took like my chest measurements right there, my um, waist, like the skinniest part of your waist measurement, hip, and then like where you want the dress to end measurement. And then you divide that by, I think it's four, I think. Yeah, you divide it by four, and then that's this measurement. I'm not teaching a tutorial today, I'm just trying to explain. I probably just confused everyone. Also, I'm really new at sewing, so like, if I'm doing something wrong and you want to correct me, I would love that. Thank you so much. Just be nice, please, because I'm sensitive. Oh, also, this is the color fabric I'm going to be doing for the dress. Um, I made a dress just like this, but it's like a um, greenish color. I'll put it here. Ding! Um, if you want to see me in it more, um, I have pictures on my Instagram, which is here. Oh god, I'm shaking. Um, let's move on. Here's like a mini room tour, by the way. This is like where I film my content. Um, that's all I'm gonna say about that. And I can't really show the rest of my room because I have like playboys all around. And I'm not trying to get my channel deleted, so yeah. But I'm about to cut out this fabric. And you have to fold it and do it twice and i'm gonna put a bunch of weights on it so that the pattern stays down and i'm gonna keep this little girl away but yeah okay so here's you want it like a lot of weight on it just because this shit will move and even i'm gonna try putting these on like the corners to hold it there so it doesn't budge while i'm cutting because that annoys me so much um, at this point, let's take a hit, take a break, and then we're gonna cut it. Alright, so let's <coughs> cut it. And I'm not going to be filming this because I will shake and mess up, and then I'll have a whole hysteric fit and not finish the video, so I'll be right back. Okay, really quick, a tip. When you're cutting, don't just go shh go back and forth slowly because if you don't do that it won't pull away like effortlessly like that you'll get little pieces like that and then it's just so annoying so make sure when you're cutting with like a rotary knife go like don't just go okay that's my little tip of the day just the tip all right so now we're just gonna take all these off and now you have one half of your dress, either the front or the back. And I sew it with like a lot of extra seam allowance just because like, I don't know, I just do. Alright, I'm gonna cut out the other half and then start sewing. Okay, so the bodice is cut out, and now I just have to cut out this bikini part. And so I'm just gonna do this twice, and then I can start sewing. Um, I also have to cut out the strips, like, to make the straps, too, so I kind of lied. But yeah, it's time to take another hit and keep going. 
This is the point where I'm like, do I want to keep going? Guess I'm gonna force myself. <laughs> okay, so everything's cut out. I just have to pin stuff together inside out. Barely had enough fucking fabric to make those straps, but thankfully I did. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. I'm gonna start sewing. So I'm just gonna fold it inside out. I'm gonna make our straps first because it's easy. And I like to use my serger for these because I feel like it holds better and it's quicker. So yeah, you just basically do that for 900 years. Okay, so now we're gonna take these straps that I just sewed and we're gonna use this wire to flip them inside out to make like the tube straps to the top of the dress. Does that make sense? All right. So you're just gonna take a piece of your wire and bend it over like that so it doesn't snag. And I'm just gonna feed it in there. This is my favorite part, it's so satisfying. Looks like intestines. Anyways. <laughs> Nobody asked. So you just snip a little piece at the end. So you can put that loop through it. gonna feed it through the opposite side carefully. It doesn't look as satisfying on camera but it feels so good to do. It's like ASMR. Get ready. See? Now you have a nice cute stretchy velvety strap. And you can do this with any fabric so it matches your, any stretch fabric. If you do it with an on-stretch, you're gonna have to add elastic, but that's why I love stretch fabric. Okay. So now I just have to do this to the rest of them. Got our straps. All right. Break. Okay, so I finished sewing the dress and I put these little heart rhinestone thingies on it and I just have to cut, ew my knee's cracking, I just have to cut a slit here and feed these two straps through and it'll go around through the back and then I'm also going to cut a slit at the bottom, the side and feed this last tube through. And then it, that just like, it makes it encase your butt nicely and it just really like, I'll show you once I put it on, but I'm going to do that in the morning because I ate so much spaghetti, I'm so bloated. So yeah, it's all done and get ready for me to rock it. <sighs> so yeah.
Okay, well, if I added the out all right, um, now we should be on to the Q&A part. So most of these questions were sex questions. I mean, are we surprised? But okay, let's get into it. <clears throat> I look crazy because I just filmed content, so like, I got sweaty. And so yeah, okay. Okay, favorite color, and Muhammad Quayon4 says, <clears throat> your favorite color. My favorite color is pink or blue. Um, Michaela BB says, how should I tell my girlfriend I'm trans? Um, I don't know. Don't ask me. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Last movie that made you laugh? I don't know. Okay, next question. What is your favorite video game? My favorite video game is SSX Tricky 3 or Call of Duty Zombies or Roblox Gorillas. All right, next question. Okay. All right, next question. What do you like to do in your spare time? Um, this. Um, next question. I want you. Is it possible? Probably not. Okay. <laughs> next question. Were you in London this weekend? No. I am in the US. I live in Oregon. Um, another sex question. Another sex question. Um, Yugak says, how much for a hoodie? Um, I've never made a hoodie yet, but we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Can we see your feet? Um, not here. <laughs> Um, next question. Single? I want to shoot my shot. Actually, they said I want to shot my shot. Okay. Next question. Single? Question mark. I want to shot my shot. Um, yes, I am single. Painfully single. But I'm really picky, so. Yeah. Next more sex questions. Okay, they're like all sex questions. Um, we can cut all this out. Okay, next question. This person wants to be anonymous. How long have you been in the business? Um, I'm assuming you mean making content online and four years. Obviously not like regular content, like content content, if you know what I mean. So yeah, <laughs> next question. And another sex question, woo! Do you prefer being top or bottom? What's your dirty secret in bed that you always W? Um, I am like a 99% bottom, but like, if you got a big hairy bubble butt, that's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> and, What's a big dirty secret in the bedroom? I don't really have any. <laughs> okay, next question. When are you coming back to Columbus? Um, who knows? Probably never. Next question. Where are you from? I'm from Columbus, Ohio, but I live in Oregon now. All right, next question from baby spit who is that on your face spinning it's because i had this on my story Ding. insert here um that's you okay next question um they were just sex questions so yeah we're done with the q 
Q&A. Thank you so much for sitting through this. I know it was such a chore. And you are going to be quizzed at the end, so I hope you were paying attention during this whole video. So, <laughs> just kidding. But yeah, here's the dress. Um, turned out cute. If you want me to like go more in depth on like how I make the shit I make, comment because I know I didn't really teach you anything in this video, and I'm just being kind of manic and just trying to get the hang of YouTube right now. So yeah, just comment like what you want to see from me. I'll probably be doing like Q and A's and stuff, all the basic like trans videos, all the girls do. So get ready for that. But yeah, um, if you want to go see other stuff I've made, check out my Instagram, Hazel underscore Lush sixty nine. And yeah, thank you for watching. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you want to be notified when I post or go live or whatever you can do on here but yeah thank you for watching bye